President Muhammad Wari has inaugurated the Kashim Bila Multipurpose Dam 40 megawatt hydropower station and associated 132 kV switchyard transmission line and distribution substation phase one project located at the Kashim Bila in Takum local government area of Taraba State. The president who spoke at a virtual ceremony held at the council chamber state house Abuja during the commission underscored the importance of the project highlighting its role in his administration's commitment to achieving the target of 30 GW of electricity in the country by 2030 under the Electricity Vision 303030. The Kishinville and Dam in Tarabo State with storage capacity of 500 million cubic meters was conceived principally to checkmate the threat of the imminent collapse of the structurally weak and poisonous Lake Nios, located at the line of volcanic activities in Cameroon Republic, which collapse could result in flooding and affecting millions of lives and properties. Even though the dam was meant to serve as a buffer, to contain possible discharge of water of Lake Nios, the engineering design maximized the benefits of the Kashimbira ecosystem by incorporating a 40 megawatt hydropower station, 60,000 cubic meter per day water supply scheme, 2,000 hectares of irrigation system and airstrip fishing activities, and tourism potentials. Minister of Water Resource Sulaiman Adamus and his counterpart in Ministry of Power, Gaudi Jedi Agba, shed more light on the projects. The execution of Kashibila Ramomo Multipurpose Dam project suffered serious setback for over 15 years. The contract was awarded in 2007 to CCC Limited with a completion period of 36 months, but was not realized due to inadequate funding and increase in scope until the advent of the Buhari administration. I'm happy to inform this August gathering that the contractor has satisfactorily completed the dam and hydropower components of the project. Presently, power generated by the Kashimila Gamovo Multipurpose Dam is being transmitted into the national grid. In addition, work is progressing well on the water supply component at about 65% completion and the irrigation company will commence in due course. The airstrip, which is another important component of the project, is currently receiving an upgrade courtesy of General T.Y. Nanjuba. This police, the Minister of Power funded and led the implementation of the electromechanical component of the 14 megawatt hydropower plant and power evacuation component. This efforts amplify our commitment to meeting the target of evaporating efficient, electricity efficient 30, 30, 30, with a, which aims to provide 30 megawatt, gigawatts of electricity by the year 2030, with renewable energy contributing about 30% to the energy mix to articulate the increase in access to electricity, specifically for renewable energy sources. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.